Most futures traders are familiar with the Superdome. You've got your standard buy, sell, and price columns. And you can see where your orders are currently at, as well as a bit of ask and bid data on where the volume is on each side of the market. But where Ninja's Superdome is different is the addition of the ATM strategies and the high amount of visual customization. The presentation isn't too bad either. In other dome windows, it can be a bit confusing and order management is a pain. However, it's easy to see from what I just have here of what we have on each side of the market. You can see that the little volume numbers in the side of the buy column are telling you where for about five ticks on each side of the last traded price where the volume is and at what level. And when I place my order, you can see what part of the volume it is as well. And the same goes for the sell side as well. Out to the left you can see my quantity and it's color coded green so it's easy to see my price right away. Once I actually have it placed you can see down at the bottom that I can change how I want to see my profits or loss and I can do it between currency, points, or percentage. Visually, I can make a few changes to make it even easier to see. I can right click and change these settings to suit what I might already be familiar with or just to make something clearer. In my case, I want to differentiate these columns so it's easier to tell which is buy side and which is sell side. So in the buy side column, I'm just going to do a light green and in the sell column, I'm going to do a light red so that they're not both just gray so I can see what's actually happening. And here I'm just going to add a little light red to it and when I apply it you can see it looks a bit like an Italian flag but on the buy side it's green and on the sell side it's red. That way I don't accidentally do something because I tend to do that when there's both gray columns there. And You can change it to any color you want. Those are a little dark. So here I'll enter another order and you can see the little red X out to the side. It's easy to cancel my order as well and that's because order management is a snap with this thing. I can click the net X next to any order to cancel it or the X at the bottom and cancel all of my live orders. Placing different types of orders is easy as well. I can either enter it specifically at the bottom or I can click on the buy or sell column to enter a limit order. I can also middle click on any one of these columns to enter a stop limit order and I can control middle click to enter a stop order. And at the bottom we have our reverse and our close buttons that allow us to quickly reverse a position or just completely close out of it. And they will cancel all of our live orders. So this has been the Superdome. If you'd like to learn more about the other features of NinjaTrader, click here to go back.